Okay, hey, what's up? Today I want to show you a quick way you can record your vocals using Cubase. Now, this tutorial is for beginners, people who just got the program and want to get started. I'm not going to give you anything you don't need, man. Just straight to the point, simple and easy. Okay? Now, the first thing, now you're going to open the program. The first thing you're going to see is that Cubase Open Documents Options. Um, that shows any saved projects you have. We don't have any saved projects right now. That's why it's empty. Click New Project. Okay, next thing you have templates. Now that's pretty much the the design of your workplace. You know what I mean? 16 MIDI track sequencer that you know making beats and all the, all all of that. A mastering setup. You don't need that right now. You don't need to know anything right now. If you just got the program, click empty. Okay. And now you can save. You can you can choose where the file can be saved, where that Cubase file would be saved. Okay. Now that's how the workplace looks. That's Cubase. <laughs> um, it, it can be pretty like intimidating at first, but yo man, once you get once you get used to it, it's okay. You know you can do everything quick and easy. So. What you want to do right now, what you want to do right now is plug in your microphone. Just plug it in, make sure it's ready to record. Once you have your microphone ready, you want to set it up. And you set it up by clicking on devices and VST connections. Now you're going to see this window. You have inputs, outputs, group effects, and all that other stuff. Um you going to see you going to see it like this you going to see that it's empty now in order to set up your microphone you just click add bus stereo 1 okay and then you have it it's automatic it's easy as shit you do you do the same thing for outputs now that's the speakers you know what i mean you going to see it like this so add output oh add bus and there you go you have it okay now you have your instrumental and I suppose that your instrumental is on a file on an mp3 file or a WAV file or something you know what I mean you downloaded it from somewhere so you gotta you gotta put that file in Cubase how, how, do, how do you do that well you find where it is see that's my file that's my instrumental okay this one all I do is I click on it and I drag it to the timeline. Boom. You see how easy it is? You just find the instrumental and then you drag and drop it. It's fucking simple. Okay, and there you have it. Just listen. Okay, ready. Now, next thing you gotta do you you and um just so you know that's called a channel yeah that that line here is called a channel now you need another channel for recording your actual verse you can create another channel by clicking on the right button of your mouse right and add audio track you click that you click mono it has to be mono though you can do it with stereo but I recommend mono because your voice you have one mouth at the end of the day man you don't have two mouths one from the right one from the left it would have been cool <laughs> but you don't have one so it's called mono okay and uh, yeah man you're ready to record uh, you just have to make sure that you just click on that button and this has to be red okay it has to be red you click on that transport record boom and you're ready now you're recording you know what I mean boom you see now that shit runs with this okay you're ready to record that's you've recorded now you probably need another channel for your for your ad-libs and for your choruses and all that but you know how to create one right right button audio track mono boom okay and you have another one it's simple so now usually what we do is um, we master it. You put like you put uh, EQ on it. You you put compression on it and all that. 
but we're gonna go into that um, next next time in the next episode. For now, I'm just gonna show you how to how to export it. So, what do you know? You know how to how to set up your microphone. You know how to uh, drag and drop your instrumental, and you know how to create uh, channels to record your lyrics at. Uh, next time, we're gonna see how we we'll, how we'll actually master it. But now I'll show you how to export it. Okay, now you have it, right? So if you want to export it, you have to click on that white white triangle and uh, highlight the area you want to export. So it's pretty much going to be like until here. Yeah, that's how much you, you want to export. If you put it until here, you're going to export all of that. But you, you, but you don't want that empty space. So you're going to export it like that. Okay. And once you have it highlighted, you go to File, Export, Audio Mix Down. And then you file name. You know, it's, it's easy. It's easy from here. You just file name, file format, and you export. And there you have it. You have your first ever recorded <laughs> verse. Oh shit, that rhymes. First ever recorded verse <laughs> using Cubase. It's simple, it's easy. Um, I recommend you try it, man. It's You know what I mean? It won't cost you anything. Okay, next time I'll show you how to master your vocals. You know what I mean? How to put that EQ, uh, how to compress it, and all of that. Okay, so that's it for, for today. See you later.